Welcome to another episode of Raider Roast My Rig. I'm your host, Fluff, and if you would like to submit your rig for rating or roasting, shoot an email on over to rateorroast at gmail.com. All right, so this one's actually pretty straightforward. I like the fact that you have a boss uh, synth module on your board. I like the fact that you're using a TC electronic sentry gate. That is my favorite gate that I tour with myself. I would love to know what is that thing on the left. I recognize the switch as a high beam switch on like an old Chrysler, but the rest of it is just like an overly large enclosure to be ironic. I would love to know, but overall solid board. I give it four and a half out of five beards. All right, this is a, this is a an interesting rig, if I may. Right off the bat, you have your guitars in, arranged in what seemed to be monetary value. You start off with a really cheap bullet strat and then you go to kind of an entry level Jackson and then you step up to a Fender and then finally a Paul Reed Smith. It's like the, the high fidelity of guitar arrangements. Uh, it's kind of interesting. Also the mandolin is cool for playing uh, those uh, REM covers on the weekends with the kids. It's probably also so you uh, don't forget where you came from. Three and a half out of five beards. All right, I love the Pro Bowl guitar. That, that, that color of the guitar is great. Your pedals, yeah. And also, are you really playing with a subwoofer? Like a, some kind of a car torpedo sub? You have definitely had one of your friends hold that in a phallic manner while playing, haven't you? Haven't you? Three out of five beards. If you think by having me on your monitor in your photo of Raider Roast My Rig will get you on the show, you're absolutely right. I love that photo, that's a great photo. I like your Paul Reed Smith SE guitar. Those are great guitars. I like your Gibson Les Paul. I like the fact that you're also concerned about your hydration so you have multiple bottles of water on your desk. Your laptop stand, I don't know if that's helping or, or causing your carpal tunnels. I don't know how you type like that or if you're primarily on the gaming keyboard or if you switch it up, do a little Elton John, not really sure. But overall, I'm gonna go ahead and give your rig three out of five beards. This room is, it's pretty awesome. I'm gonna be real with you guys. Choice guitars, choice amplifiers, except for the Black Star. This room can get real loud, but shoes are not allowed. Four out of five beards. I got a Mesa Boogie 412. I got a Power Kemper Rack. I have a couple of choice Ibanezes. I don't have a man cave, but I have half a living room. Four to five beards. I don't know what this homemade guitar is, what I'm assuming is homemade or heavily modified, but it's kind of cool. I can't help but think this is in some kind of a church basement or something. Those speakers look like the kind of speakers that were in my great grandfather's uh, organ room when I was a kid. Th those look very old and probably shouldn't be used for what you're using them for. I also really like the teeny tiny amplifier that's on top. It's just kind of like, hey guys, can I come along too? And then like the amplifier's mom like makes the rest of them take it. But overall, I like your hustle. So I'm gonna give it three out of five beards. Once again, we have more guitars in timeout. Who hangs their guitars like that on the wall? I mean, besides you, of course, because I can see that you do. Also, why is that 12 string or 16 or 23, 56 string not in timeout. What did it not do? Because I'm pretty sure it deserves to be in timeout if any of those guitars deserve to be in timeout. But overall, I'm gonna give it four out of five beards. This is a pretty straightforward rig. A classic Ampeg rig with a, a Fender Jazz bass and a dark glass B7K. I love those. You also really like stickers. I mean, when I say like stickers, like you like stickers like the rest of us like living. You really, really like stickers. You probably also have a lot of tattoos because tattoos are just stickers for the body, am I right? But I'm gonna give your rig four and a half out of five beards. That does it for this episode of Ringo Roast, my rig. Feel free to send more rigs on over and maybe you'll be in a future episode of Rate or Roast, my rig. Fluff out.